Breathe it through your nose, out through your mouth. Remember everybody, when you're out here training, make sure that you train hard, okay? Get some strength training, resistance training, whatever you got to do, get that into your system. Get that into your lifestyle, alright? Because think about it. When you're training like this, so if you're, say if you're a paramedic or you're a nurse or you are a surge tech or uh, just in healthcare in general, firefighter, um, police officer, you know, uh, corrections officer, let me scratch that, corrections officer, you into, you into that, those lines of work, think about it. If you're not physically fit, you're probably going to get hurt. So you need to train like a football player, basically. Because of twisting and lifting and bending, those things like that. When you train with resistance training or weight training, get yourself a good fitness trainer. Myself, very good fitness trainer. Um, because that's how I train myself. So you guys get that work in and train hard, right? Because it'll help you long term. So if you get any kind of injury, get any kind of, or get any kind of injuries, or if you get any kind of scuffles that might lead to some kind of injury, they're pretty much preventable because you're stronger. Because most of the people that you're dealing with are, you know, might be stronger than you if you're not physically fit. And here comes the accidents. Here comes the debilitating uh, situations where you can't function the rest of your life properly. So we're out here, make sure that we keep that up, keep the cardio, keep the, um, the strength training with the resistance bands, the kettlebells, work like that. That's how you got to get it done. It's not easy, it's not supposed to be easy, but it'll pay off in the long run. And that's my fitness tip for the day. This has been L.A. Kendrick, part two of that. You guys be safe, and until the next time.